people need to uh, find their true self. If they don't find the, their true self, they always have fear, worry, all kinds of emotions. Hmm. Hmm. Joyful. And, uh, they always want to. Oh, their inside become more confident. Oh, this is me. Hmm. They start to know how to manage their consciousness. Life. Yeah, I have to find a way. So I remember uh, I went to the mountains. I want to find a Taoist master or Buddhist master to follow the master and become a monk. But I couldn't. Uh, I am burned in a small village and the uh, west, northwest of China in a remote place. Uh, there is a very poor, a poor place. When I was in the high middle school, I want to find a life purpose, but I couldn't. Then my life is blocked. I want to liberate my life. I have to find a way. So I remember uh, I went to the mountains. I want to find a Taoist master or Buddhist master to follow the master and become a monk. But I couldn't. One day, uh, one of my roommates tell me his grandfather will teach Jinan Qigong in the school. So I I feel I found something very good. Maybe this can change my life. Hmm. Okay, that's a long story. Yeah, that time oh, I was a teenager, hmm. about uh, 17 years old. You know, for me, now I think back. That time of my life is very simple because my family is farmer. I think maybe I grew up, I also will become a farmer. If I, my school study is very good, maybe I become a teacher or work in the government something like that. But I didn't like all this. So later, I practiced the Jinan Qigong. In Jinan Qigong, I find my life purpose. This is very important. And uh, same time, when I started practicing Jinan Qigong, maybe one year, I healed my problems. That time uh, I had a very serious nose problem. <laughs> Always, uh, yeah, nose inside painful, head inside painful, and a cough. Mm. Each year in the spring, I cough a lot too. Mm. About maybe one month, two months, three months. Mm. Very hard. But since I practiced Junin Qigong, Three months, I healed all those problems. Hmm. So this is a very good uh, change on my physical body. Mm -hmm. In my consciousness, I find uh, life purpose. This is more important. <laughs> yeah, like I told you, in high middle school, I couldn't find a life purpose. Mm -hmm. You know, that's a very suffering thing for a life. I feel our meanings, 
no meaning life. Yeah. Even my school study, I was very, very good. At, but no meaning. Mm. Why I live in this world? So inside that, you feel no motivation, no good intention. The life um, just like many people every day, uh, study, eating, don't know the future. Yeah. Mm. But when I study Jinan Qigong in the book, mm. in a simple method book, Dr. Pan told Jinan Qigong is the way of liberating human life to create a harmonious world. So suddenly my heart inside become bright. Oh, this is my life direction. Mm -hmm. Since then, I had a life mission until now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So this is support my life to today. I feel more and more beautiful. Yes. Yeah. Would you say that your life mission is to be a Xinen Qigong teacher and to share this practice with the world? Uh, not only so simple. Mm. Mm. So that time on, um, I found the meaning from Zhenen Qigong. The meaning is um, to create a harmonious world. Mm. And let the whole world become harmonious. Mm. Because uh, um, when I was small, I always find the conflict in the family between people and people, uh, many fighting not very harmonious so mm. yeah so um, when i find this life meaning then suddenly i feel it's great i find this is human com common dream human dream <laughs> not only my dream <laughs> yeah so later i work on this direction 10 years ago uh, in China, um, at Wuda Mountain, I created an uh, uh, organization we called uh, the World Harmonious Big Family. Hmm. So this name came from uh, many years ago, my life uh, purpose. Yes. So until today, uh, I created uh, um, the World Consciousness Community. It's also for this purpose. So gradually, gradually, I find um, the more uh, essential way, the essence to create mm -hmm. the harmonious world. Yeah. Now I focus on teacher Mingjue. Mm. Mm. Through I teaching Jinan Qigong many years, mm. gradually I found people need to uh, mm, find the essence. People learn many methods. Uh, they can get benefit, but when they practice, practice, at the end, they don't know which method they should practice because of too much. Mm. Yeah. So gradually, gradually, I find, oh, now I need to teach consciousness. Mm. People need to uh, find their true self. If they don't find the, their true self, they always have fear, worry, all kinds of emotions. Hmm. And then they always want to find something, find new things. But once they can experience a little about 
their inner observer, they start to become peaceful, quiet, mm, joyful. Oh, their inside become more confident. Oh, this is me. Mm. They start to know how to manage their consciousness. Yeah. Before, they always manage their body, their energy. They don't know how to control and manage consciousness. Mm. But since I taught Mingjue, uh, Mingjue is Chinese word. Mingjue mm. mm. means uh, a clear observation. You know, everybody inside there is an observer. But the observer observe its self, know its self state, self aware state. This is called Mingyue. Once people experience this observer, hmm, inner master, true self, they start to become quiet. Mm. Then they develop this Mingyue, true self state power, and in turn, use this power, work on body, work on qi, their change mm, is really amazing, mm, wonderful. Yes. Mm. So now I like to practice Mingjue. I built the, um, the Mingjue Kung Fu community. We also call it the World Consciousness Community. In this community, people, Mingyue level, pure consciousness connect together from a consciousness field. Mm. In this consciousness field, um, people support each other like one heart. Yes. Yeah, this is very important. 